What up, YouTube? Uh, your boy J. Indiana Jones. And, uh, let me just get to it, man. This is how they do it, y'all. They, um, they tap into the free energy. And, it, and it's different things. Like, some people do astrology. Some people do, like, metaphysics. Some people do numerology, alchemy. It's different things you can do. It's different sciences. Uh, it's like different principles for the uh, same results. But what they do is they would tap into this energy and then they will put it inside of a median. And we go to that to get that source of power. So they direct, they go on, they get the, it's like having a plug, like, uh, in the middleman. See, middleman is there. Because some people, they mess with the middleman. Some people, they cool with the middleman. Like, that's my homie. I'm going to go to my homie to get whatever he know what to get that I need. Man, he got the plug to it. And some people don't mess with their middleman. So it's like, it's just like, okay, I'm going uh, to contact him whenever to get something. And it could be whatever you want to get. You know, it's just somebody that you go through who's going to the direct source. So they give us these media. And that's where we get our, our power from. I mean, we go to the cable company to get the internet and the cable and stuff and they getting it from the source they the middle man so I wanted to talk about Iron Man so Iron Man is this a spoiler alert if you ain't seen the end games that's your fault but the death of Iron Man was pretty much saying I'm the guy I'm the middleman it was the death of the middleman the death of Iron Man was the death of the man and uh Tony Starks that boy was bad like uh I went ahead and I, I put the in the description the link uh to the page I pulled up but it was like 15 uh top inventions from Tony Stark I wrote a few of them down like uh, the arc reactor the arc reactor uh, was the little thing on his chest that kept him alive and what I got uh, beyond propel uh, beyond propelling the armor suit his power has enhanced his already genius intelligence uh, endowing him with inhuman multitasking abilities higher cognitive functions and insane learning speeds so yeah he made that he made the repulsor blast that's the thing in his hand that shoot and how it was created was high density blasts of charged particles directed by magnets okay uh veronica that was uh that you know the hope buster the, the suit the hope was where well it's the deployment devices so it's basically the intelligence for that soup it send it where it need to go and all that he has something called the new element hmm new element you know we know he made Otron he made the uh, uh, anti-gravity device uh, you know he made this Iron Man spider suit he had uh, jet power uh, roller skates that can go 60 miles per hour and they used to use them in gaming and stuff like that then you go to start thinking of movies have how they be out there with the rollerblades going at extreme speeds you know what i'm saying yeah you say okay i heard man he was on something what else he did um uh a big one uh now jarvis or homer uh j dot a dot r dot um v dot i dot s or h dot o dot m dot e dot r you know all capitalized 
that's the AI and it was artificial intelligence artificial intelligence Iron Man created artificial intelligence that's that thing that he talked to all the time that helped him in the suit it was well sophisticated they even compared it to um, modern day technology like our AI on Google or something right now compared to Iron Man technology is so sophisticated and the sophistication of what Stephen Hawkins had said that will be the death of humanity if they let the AI get that smart so that's deep right there that's deep then uh, when you watch the Avengers though you notice they was doing all this time travel too this, this quantum science and physics and stuff but they was doing time travel so then I'm like so when you get to talking about time travel you know I think I I mean not Einstein but Einstein was uh, dealing with this uh, but it was really uh, Tesla because they was going back and forth about this and uh, see so with Tesla um, he had to fill it they had the Philadelphia experiment you know he was already gone um, but when they did the Philadelphia experiment it was still you know directed to Nikola Tesla then you think of people like uh, Elon Musk and uh, Bill Gates Bill Gates tapped into like you know like Microsoft um, the computers and stuff the internet the ethernet you know and then you Elon Musk he uh, making the cars like Tesla all that stuff and using Tesla name like come on people you got to think about this the death of spider I mean the Iron Man the death to Iron Man see Iron Man was your Tesla he was your Bill Gates this is Iron Man because he's the one that's going to the source to get it and giving it to you as the middleman so since it was the death of uh, Iron Man and then see now the Marvel going into the cosmic you think the cosmic energy is is different uh, different source of power which is just a higher beam of power that's what's and it's, it's basically I think that's pretty much saying our time is coming now like our time is coming I mean, with our time coming you know that's gonna take us to a whole nother level but what Iron Man was doing has been the middleman is also letting us know that we can directly go to that source now we can go to that direct source so that's all I really wanted to talk about uh, just talking about Iron Man a little bit and how he was tapped into the free energy and their time is like over with now no more middleman we can't go to the middleman no more we gotta go we gotta become the plugs ourselves bottom of the line we have to but uh yeah i just had to get that off my chip quick your boy j indiana jones hit the like button dislike button subscribe and drop a comment below let me know what you think let me know if you want me to talk about something else just holla at your boy and uh peace and love deuce